Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. It's an honor to speak at such an occasion when Sahel Consulting is celebrating 10 years of its existence and service to a critical segment of our economies. We also celebrate you, Ndidi, and your leadership. You have demonstrated that an African woman can lead successful businesses, and now many of us look up to you. According to the African Agricultural Status Report produced last year by Agra, the African private sector handles 80% of the food consumed on the continent, 90% of the food eaten away from where it's produced, and 64% of the food eaten in our cities. In a nutshell, without these SMEs that the report calls the hidden middle, we would all starve. More than ever, there's greater need to have a stronger collaboration between the public and private sector in agriculture. We must not relent in our concerted effort to double down and partner with African governments and the private sector to deliver on SDG2. We still have 250 million people that are going to bed hungry every night. I always say that even one hungry person is one too many amidst the plenty we are living in today. Today, we celebrate Africa's SMEs playing a key role in delivering technologies, extension, markets, and financial services to smallholder farmers. These African SMEs are dynamic. They are working very hard to produce drought tolerant seed varieties, to provide automated credit scoring tools to farmers, or even to make tractors available through the most recent innovations like Uber for tractors that allows farmers to access tractor services through their mobile phones. Most of these SMEs are owned by young people and driven by data. Sahel's work to transform Africa's agriculture and nutrition landscape is an example of this vibrance. And indeed, congratulations are in order. At Agra, we see strengthening SME capacity as critical to giving African farmers choices in technologies to increase yield, to ensuring markets and increased incomes, and to reducing waste. Putting on my special envoy hat, we see SMEs as central to the transition that Africa's food systems must have. Agra is committed to SME growth. That's why we are partnering with the AGRF partners to host an annual deal room. This September alone, 280 SMEs seeking over $500 million had the opportunity to engage with over 55 investors from across the globe with a focus on Africa. We are working with all stakeholders to translate these deals on the ground. Business like Ndidis and many others on the continent suggest that Africa has a lot going on. We need to learn and adopt what is working. We need to advance these SMEs. We need to support them, especially women and youth SMEs. And most of all, we need to celebrate their success. Congratulations again, Sahel at 10. Congratulations, Ndidi. And thank you all.